Executive chef and partner at Spiaggia is Paul Bartolotta. In 1997, this Milwaukee native received an award from the President of Italy, honoring his culinary achievements and calling him a goodwill ambassador for all things Italian. His entree is a light rendition of langoustines in tomato and orange sauce. Scampi con fonduta di pomodoro, arancia e menta. And what it means is chilled tomato, orange, and mint sauce that is served with warm poached langoustinos, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna clean one of these so you get an idea how you might clean it. You first, you pull the bottom part off, okay? And then you will crack them a little bit this way. All right, and then you just peel them open just a little bit. Make sure you broke through. And then you just peel the shell off this way. And then this piece of shell here too as well. Okay, and then at the very bottom, you just sort of hold, and you also will get any of the inside to come and peel out at the same time. Okay, and then what we'll do is we'll trim it up a little bit. If there's any parts that's a, not so beautiful, we're gonna trim that. We're gonna trim this a little bit, okay. And this is the clean langoustino. And as you can see, I have those already prepared for you. Okay, so we'll put that together with this one. Okay, in addition, I have some, some tomatoes that I simply scored at the top and cut, the, cut the, uh, the bottom off. I blanched it in very, very hot boiling water and then I shocked it immediately after, it was only in the water a few seconds, in ice water, and that allowed the skin to peel off very easily, so I have some peeled tomatoes that for this particular dish, your enemy will always be excessive liquid. So we're gonna take and cut this a little bit. And we're just gonna take this off. This particular dish is a dish that can be done only when you have good tomatoes. If you don't have a good tomato, don't even bother. And right now we have some nice um, plum tomatoes that are nice and ripe, so So all I want is the supreme part. And then, when we get done with this, I will show you the garnish that we do with this. We make little diamonds here by cutting it and then cutting it at an angle. And this is about the size diamond that we want to use. Okay. And then we have an orange that we, we peel to make segments. And what we do is we peel very carefully. We cut either side of the, of the orange off peel it down real nice and smooth so we retain its shape, and then basically make some nice segments out of the orange. And this is gonna be used for both making the sauce and also for the garnish. So the dish will be prepared this way. We're gonna take a pot and we're gonna warm up a Ligurian olive oil in here. So you want an, an olive oil that's very, very light. You don't want anything that's too strong. And I'm gonna put in here a few mint bouquets. And I leave the stem on because it's not gonna cook very long. So we're just gonna make it just, just a little bit warm. We do not wanna make it extremely hot. We just wanna cook it long enough so we extract the flavor of the mint into the oil. And we flavor the oil just a little bit. Okay, so to this I'm gonna add some of the tomato segments here. So the tomato supreme to the dish. And then again, some of the orange. And once again, I reemphasize that liquid is your enemy, so you wanna keep this a real nice dry compote. Salt is added. Not a lot, just a little bit. And while we're at it, for poaching the langoustinos, we're gonna put some salt in the water for these as well. Okay, so these are our langoustinos. Okay, so we're just gonna cook this very, very slowly. We wanna make a little bit of a pulp. You can already smell the flavor of the mint coming out. 
and we just want to cook this very, very slowly. It's not a long cooking process. It's basically to make everything nice and warm and set all the flavors been, blend together. It's essentially a, a cold dish, so we don't want to give the impression that it is a cooked tomato sauce or that it takes on the flavor of, of a cooked orange. We want to leave it nice and light and nice and fresh. The mixture is chilled over an ice bath, then processed. Garnish includes a chiffonade of mint with pieces of tomato and orange warmed through. Okay. The mint was removed before the hand processor is used. Strain the sauce before presentation. We're going to now warm up this a little bit and poach a few of our langostinos in boiling water. And I just curl them over so they re retain a nice curled shape. We'll do just say one extra. The compote is placed on the chilled sauce. We're going to garnish this with a nice mint bouquet. Okay, and then just a drizzle of the oil, just right here on top. Thank you.